Everything you have heard about the upcoming iPhone 15 is entirely false. What? What the f For months, rumors have circulated that Apple intends to do away with the dependable physical volume and power buttons on the next iPhone 15 Pro. But wait for it. The latest word on the street is that they will actually be sticking around after all. What is the reason? So we're trying to find out. Well, join us to discuss that. Why the change? That's the real question. I'll tell you why. Over the years, Apple's smartphones have always featured physical buttons. But Apple hoped to change the physical buttons to a solid state with the iPhone 15. However, some technological know-how is needed to make the solid state buttons function, and this is more complex to do. As a result, there are no solid state buttons for the upcoming iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 15 Pro Max. According to analyst Ming Shikchuo, there were some technical issues that couldn't be fixed in time for mass production. Oh, remember when Kuo said that the iPhone 15 Pro would have those solid state buttons back in October? Of course I remember! So basically, he said the new iPhone would have two extra taptic engines, making it feel like you're pressing buttons even though they won't actually move. However, in the Medium post, he spilled the beans that the devices are going to have mechanical buttons after all. His post read, My latest survey indicates that due to unresolved technical issues before mass production, both high-end iPhone 15 Pro models, Pro and Pro Max, will abandon the closely watched solid-state button design and revert to the traditional physical button design. Nevertheless, it is still possible that Apple may stick with the single, extended volume button that has been speculated about despite the traditional design. Quo believes that Apple has ample time to make changes to the creation of the iPhone 15 Pro since the device is still in the engineer validation test development stage. It looks like we'll have to wait until the iPhone 16 in 2024 to get our hands on those fancy solid state buttons. And while we wait, subscribe to our channel for the latest updates on Apple Tech. At your service. Anyway, Analyst Revan just dropped a bomb on Twitter claiming that the rumors about canceling the mass production of solid state buttons are fake. So don't lose hope yet. The iPhone 15 Pro with solid state buttons might still be hitting the assembly line. According to the analyst, Apple has already placed an order for the necessary components, and it's definitely happening. Or perhaps Apple's playing a sneaky plan to throw off the leakers and keep us guessing. Either way, solid state buttons would have been fantastic. They're super durable and can handle water. Having fewer moving parts means there's less chance for things to break down and wear out over time. That means Apple wouldn't have to make space for the buttons in the iPhone's frame. But are you a team solid state button or do you prefer the classic clicky button? Spill the tea in the comments section. Regardless, it is unknown if this would also have an effect on the new Mute Switch, which is expected to have more excellent functioning as a result of the redesign. Let's discuss what's going on with that. Don't go anywhere. No mute switch. iPhones have a mute switch that allows you to toggle quickly and easily without having to pull the phone out of your pocket, handbag, drawer, or wherever you keep it to check the screen. So for example, if you are at a movie theater, turning on your phone might be distracting to other patrons, particularly if you're the kind of person who utilizes their phone's maximum brightness. However, Apple is changing this switch to something else, which offers more functionalities because, let's face it, if you always put your phone on silent, you will barely use the mute switch, which means it might not be useful to you. And for those who love the mute switch, it is being altered. But it does not mean you can put your phone on silent at your convenience. And with this replacement, features not possible with conventional mute switch will become available. The mute switch is being phased out in favor of a more versatile action button that can toggle many audio settings. Simultaneously, mockups have surfaced that depict what seems to be a new action button. However, the action button will give some Android UIs a run for their money with a plethora of customization options. We're talking about jumping into all sorts of fantastic system and UI features like the app library. Do not disturb modes, notifications, and the lock screen. Plus, we can switch between cameras, snap a screenshot, and even toggle the silent mode on and off. One thing is for certain, there is no stopping them. 
Although our video today has eliminated one of the key improvements that were supposed to be coming to this year's iPhone Pros, there are other rumored advancements on the horizon, like using a USB-C charging connector rather than lightning. So, check out our next video for more information.